Hi, my name is Katie Brosnan. I'm a registered nurse here in Austin, Texas. And the question is how to get rid of yeast in the body. Well, you, you really don't want to get rid of yeast in the body. It's natural to our body and we need it to offset and balance uh, the bacteria that's naturally occurring in our body. So you don't totally want to get rid of the yeast, but you do want to make sure that it's not overproduced, that you're not having an overproduction of yeast. And so some of the ways that you can do that is um, avoiding overuse of antibiotics. This decreases the natural bacteria and then it, it allows for yeast to be overproduced. Um, if you can avoid using any sort of immunosuppressants, prednisone, cortisone, that sort of thing, as well as um, hormone replacement, if those can be avoided, a lot of times they can't, but if they can be, then that's probably a good idea to help prevent the overproduction of yeast. Another thing is doing preventative, um, taking preventative measures. So eating something like yogurt, which is a probiotic, so that helps continue to have the natural acidophilus in your intestines, which will offset the yeast. Um, avoiding large amounts of sweets, especially if you're a diabetic, the yeast is gonna thrive on the sugars and it's gonna overproduce a lot easier than it would in a normal person. So that's really important. Um, also wearing proper clothing. Um, with women, we wanna be using um, cotton panties as opposed to synthetics. You don't wanna be sitting in wet clothes for too long. Um, good, good hygiene. You wanna be wiping from front to back and not vice versa. Um, and those are just, those are some of the ways that you can be preventing an overproduction of yeast, but you don't wanna get rid of your yeast altogether.